my friends welcome to my channel so for today's recipe I am going to make a cinnamon roll poke cake so first of all we're going to take the cake mix cut that open pour it into the mixer Roll that out then we're going to add one and a quarter cups water like always, don't worry about the ingredients. I'll put it in the description below. A third cup oil. Three eggs that I've beaten already. Put this on. So I'm going to beat this for two minutes until it's smooth. Then I'm going to put it in this greased 9 by 13 pan, I just greased the bottom of it. I preheated the oven to 350 degrees. So I'm going to just do this. I don't want to put it on because it's too noisy. And once the cake is done, we'll do the next step. So I'll see you soon. Hi, welcome back. So I baked the cake in the oven for about 29 minutes until when I put a toothpick, it came out clean. So it looks like that. So I'm just going to put that aside for a second while I make the filling. So I have this big measuring cup. To that I'm going to pour in one cup sweetened condensed milk. It's pretty thick so you need to use a spoon to get everything out. Most of that. Okay, and then Third cup malted margarine for butter. Half a cup of brown sugar packed in. Just a sprinkle of salt. And one teaspoon of cinnamon. So we're going to stir this all up. Get it combined. Okay. Looks like that. Okay, I'm just going to set that aside for a second. So bring the cake back. And using end of the spoon we're going to poke some holes. Our famous poke cake. I let the cake cook about, or sorry, I let it cool for about 20 seconds or 20 minutes. My goodness, where's my head today? Just kind of cleaning off the spoon so it doesn't get too crazy. Okay. I just don't want to have too much of the cake crumbs on the top. Okay, then we get our filling. And then we're going to just pour it. I'm trying to aim for the all the holes that I've poked. So the filling can go to the bottom of the cake. Just keep spreading it around, filling up those holes. So all the filling is used. Okay. 
spoon. Yeah, get all of that yummy goodness all over the cake. Okay, and spread it a little bit gently. Try not to tear up the cake. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to let this sit and cool completely. Then I'm going to cover it with some Cool Whip for the topping. So I don't want to put it now because it's still a little bit warm. So we'll come back for that. See you soon. Hi everyone, welcome back. So the cake is cooled and I have my Cool Whip here. So I'm just going to spoon some over the cake, spread it around. Corners. That's good. There you go. It is my cinnamon roll poke cake. Hope you enjoyed that. Have a wonderful day and I'll talk to you soon. Bye for now.